Hey, Cook students, what is up? I am at the church in a room that is probably familiar to some of you, right? I'm there in the uh, one of the girls' um, small group rooms, right? Um, Kendall and Joy's small group room, to be exact. And I wanted to read some scripture for you today, and just for us to be reminded of just how great our God is, and um, and you know who He is to us, and what He means to us, and man, just to, to be reminded of His goodness and how we are to walk in this in this world. Second Corinthians five seven says, "For we walk by faith and not by sight." Right? We walk by faith and not by sight. Very short passage of scripture for us today in our daily devo. Uh, and yes, I do recognize that I missed out Tuesday. Uh, my apologies. But we walk by faith, not by sight. Right? I love this passage of scripture and uh, what it means for us as followers of Jesus Christ. You know, that uh, especially right now in this time that we're in and, and what we're traveling through and traversing through right now and walking through. But uh, all of those are just different words for uh, movement and walking, but, um, you know, this whole idea that, you know, sometimes you don't see, right, the end game, you know, not, I'm not talking about the Avengers, but sometimes you don't see the end game and you don't know what's out there in front of you and you don't know what's coming soon. And so, um, man, you just have to go without knowing. I don't know if you've ever had to do that or um, if you've ever been a part of something where like, you know, like a trust fall or something where you fall without knowing if somebody's going to catch you and hopefully somebody did every single time. But walking through this life and our faith and journey is is kind of like that, right? Uh, we don't know what's ahead, or, okay? Uh, but we know the one who has paved the way. We know the one who calls us, who loves us, who is our father, right? Our God who has created everything. And so because of that, we can have confidence uh, that we can walk by faith and not by sight, right? That even if we didn't know what was happening, if we had our eyes closed and we were just traveling through this world, man, we could just take hold of God, right? in his hand and let him lead us and let him guide us through this thing that we called life. And so, man, I, I want to just encourage you today that um, whatever you're going through, whatever you're facing, you know, it may not be something completely outside of this pandemic that we're facing right now. It could be uh, a diagnosis or something maybe going on at home. I don't know. But whatever it is, would you trust in God? Would you trust that, that you can walk by faith, right? And, and that you don't have to see what's coming next. You don't have to see what's around the corner because you know the one who, who created the corner. You know the one who can see past the mountain, who can see into the valley, who can see what's coming next and who has already planned it out. Take his hand, Trust in him, man, and let's walk through this thing called life together by faith, right? Hey, I love you. I hope you have a great day.